September 18th. Just a few days after I was out here that last time at the cow fields, we're in a different field. Got some, some dirt turned over. Got the horseshoe with me today. Today is Saturday. And he has come up on something. Said it looks like a big blade. He didn't realize what it was. See what was sticking out right there. That's how it was. That's all it was. I mean, it was, yep, and I pulled it out. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> A blade. That is a nice blade. That's barely thin. Yeah. Okay. Maybe an adze or something. Yeah. Because that's got a bit end on it, don't it? Mm. Working down somewhat. Yeah. Got some tripping on it, man. That's cool. I, yeah, I'll take it. Blade, adze. <laughs> Heck yeah. All right. Well, we just getting started. We'll see what else we can find. This hadn't been the hottest field of all the sites out here. As every hilltop has artifacts on it. You have a hilltop and then the little draw comes back up. Just check all your high spots, folks, because the creek's running inside the wood line all the way down. All right, we'll see what happens. All right, horseshoe's got something here. He said, yeah, that kind of does look like a tool. It's worked, whatever it is. Got some cortex on it. Oh, there you go. There's a piece of citronelle gravel that they were starting on. That edge. Yep. I love it, seeing how they were... The original rock with a little bit of working on it very cool thank you all right still going <laughs> well you know some things you can you can attribute to the horseshoe <laughs> and I, as we're walking these little rows you can see the little rows kind of helps us keep up with where we're walking but he said all right because we, we're coming away from the creek coming out into the middle of the field and it, it just kind of dies off you get into you get out of the flakes the sites seem to be more concentrated closer to the creek but he said all right i'm jumping over to the next row and i started to tell him all right well you jump too and i'll jump to the inside and i didn't say it and as soon as he jumped over to the row that for some reason my mind told me go to that row he says oh my goodness <laughs> That's just the way it works out. All right. Oh. Uh, thank you, Lord. Y'all look at my point. <laughs> <laughs> That's a kill shot. <laughs> Dad, gum it. Well, okay. hey, I got a few the other day, so it was his turn. Yeah. He couldn't get away. He, uh, he, he was swamped at work, so he, he deserves it. <laughs> Hard, hard as it is for me to say. <laughs> All right, we're still going, guys. We got plenty of ground to walk. Probably got some storm moving in here pretty soon. Some more rain. We've had our share. But it's a good thing when you got a field to walk. Zach just walked up on this. A little heartbreaker. Yeah. Oh, it's the end. Dang. I bet that's got some sleep through it, too. I bet it do, too. <laughs> All right, still going. Gosh. All right. Y'all hear that? And the thunder roll. And the thunder roll. If this is an ads, and if, if it's not broken on this side, this is going to be my best ads to date. That is not broken. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty. Look at the colors in that thing, man. Mm-hmm. All day long. I'll take those. Very nice. Thank you, Lord. All right. Still going. See, I wish he'd have just come the other day. <laughs> He got another one. He got another one. That's TQ. I That's one. So. Yeah. Just showing up. Oh, yes. Yeah. Look, find the little, the little spirit tree. We'll call that the little spirit tree out in the middle of the field. Yeah. Just one little tree. Go out there by the little tree. <laughs> That's nice. Thank you. That looks like that's going to be a Cotico, probably. Okay. Cotico Creek. Sweet. Thank you. 
All right. Lower. Late archaic. And that late archaic early woodland era. Hey, this spot right in, out in here, there's a little concentration right out in there. We're hoping to get into some stuff there. It's kind of sporadic out through here. But we found a few. We still got high hopes. We'll get back. Old geese. They're circling us. We were sitting here watching the geese talking about how slow they were moving and how easy of a target they would be if we were goose hunters. And almost walked over this. Oh, bless. Yeah. Let that have a base on it. <clears throat> oh, it's got pressure. Mm hmm. Oh, come on, come on, baby, one time. Yep. Oh, yeah. 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 That's going to be that Tom Bigby slash Edward stemmed. A little flattened off base down there, cortex. All right. Got me a whole point for the day. Kill shot. Love it. All right. Thank you, Lord. Still going. Mm. Saw it from a distance. Hello, plowed field or dust fields. Ugh. But it could be an ancient break. You never know. Pretty rock, though. Could have been a cool looking point. Still happy to have it. Still going. Good morning and welcome back to Pine Belt Relics. Guys, beautiful, beautiful bluebird skies. The Lord has blessed us with some perfect digging weather this morning. Hope everybody's doing well. And as always, guys, we're praying for you, lifting you up. And uh, we're back here on Gopher Ridge today. It is September 25th, 2021. And of course, I've got the horseshoe the guy everybody loves to hate. <laughs> uh, and we've got a guest with us today, Mr. Chris Johnson, guys. Happy to have him with us. He's uh, trying his hand out at some, some digging. And it didn't take us too long. I'd say what, maybe 20 minutes? Yeah. Yes, and we're up on our first artifact here. And I'm y'all don't have to think or wonder too hard about who <laughs> who's first to strike. I pulled it out and stuck it back. It's, it looks whole. I see it looks looks like the base of a yeah. stem sticking out of the wall. Oh yeah. yeah. Well, that's gonna be a nice stem, is that? Yeah. Well, that's kind of crude. But... That's a salsa point, thick and chunky. <laughs> but I'll take it. <laughs> but hey, it's an artifact. Yeah. It is fully worked. And of course, guys, that's gonna be a knife. And although I'm not gonna try to call a type on that one, it's a little tough and. Yeah. A little on the crude side, but I'm going to call that in that uh, woodland era. All right. Pretty colors, though, man. Yeah, thank you. All right. Good job. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. We're still on them, folks. All right. Y'all hang with us. You know how we do it. If we find them, we bring it to you. Hang in there. All right. Up on another one here with the, the horseshoe. Oh, that looks like a pretty tip. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thank you, Lord. I guess they broke it and reworked it. Or did I break that? Uh, That's not fresh, is it? I don't think so. There you go, folks. Hmm. Little punch train type. Think so? I think so. Got a median ridge. Okay. All right. Keep going, son. I'll do it. All right, guys. Hang in there. <laughs> All right. I'm getting a lesson here, I reckon. <laughs> I have been in some material. I'm I'm digging right there. And I have been in them. I should have been in 
10 points by now, but Zach's over here. I peaked, y'all, I peaked. But that's where it was. Oh, oh man. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you, Laura. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Let me kill shot. Pringle. Son. I'll take it. Anyway, they're not <laughs> impressed. We'll get back. Anyway, here we go. I ain't even gonna say nothing. I was walking around looking at these old spools, Paul. It may not be nothing, but it sure looks pretty. It's there. Yeah. Wow, thank you, Lord. Yep, yeah, that was probably me missed it. Mr. Gary. Years ago. But I found it this time. I was saving it for later. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, I found a killer, killer broke. Uh, it was beveled down it's uh what's the word i'm looking for translucent yeah i was super translucent but uh anyways it's beveled it, it it's got to be an old point but the base is missing off of it i'll show y'all here in a little bit y'all hang in there all right guys it's been 20 minutes since i found that one the spoils pile over here and got in this uh what we call the altaga hole roll one out it's not an altaga i don't believe i don't know what you call that point though i'll take it thank you lord We got a little while to go. We'll get back if we find something. <clears throat> All right, so here's the, uh, this is the one that I rolled out earlier that I'm, you can see that whole edge is beveled, good flaking. Translucent, where's the sun? Anyways. Good and thin, well worked. Beveled, missing the base. And then I've just rolled all of this out. That's a broken Madison, has a tip. And then you see this, all that came out of right in here. And I just rolled this out. He's giddy. Oh, I'm giddy, all right. This dude has put on a clinic all day long. And I've been in good material too, and that's the crazy thing. You see it laying right there. That indention in the wall right there is where this baby just rolled out from. <clears throat> Sorry. Oh, yeah. You like that kind of thing? Yeah, I like that kind of thing. That was worth waiting on. But this... This spot kind of shocked me here. Mm, I, don't, I don't really know what to call that. I guess that's got a little bit of a. a yeah, it's got a. Yeah, it's a punch train. And a sweet one. Look at that kill shot. Mmm. Yes, sir. All day, baby. Thank you, Lord. All right. We're going to go a little bit longer, guys. If we get something else, we'll bring it. All right, guys. We're about to wrap it up here. Just show you what we found. Just since I found that last point. That piece of pottery. 
Nick, can hold, hold it? Can you get it back in the... There ain't no sun right here. Either. Yeah. Y'all look at... The, looks familiar. <laughs> looks <laughs> got a lot like that pot he dug up here a while back. But we're way away from where he found that. Several yards. And then he just put, rolled out this little bird point. But hold your fingernail up there. Give him a... That thing is tiny with a needle tip man all right well we had a pretty good day guys yeah. especially zach <laughs> but i came away with a smoker so i uh it was a success my back's killing me but i ain't gonna complain too much god gave us a beautiful day and a and a good day of digging so glad y'all could uh join us guys again we hope everybody's doing well as always, we appreciate you watching, and uh, y'all take care. Hopefully, we'll be back out here next weekend with some more pretty weather and some more artifacts. Thanks, guys.